Good day. Welcome to the Harvard Extension School. I'm Dean Hunt Lambert, and I'm really pleased to be able to talk with you today. It's a cold, dark, wet day in Cambridge today. But when I look out the window, I see something very different. I see sunny. I see hopeful. I see glorious, in fact. Because I see a world out my window sitting here in Cambridge that has the lowest poverty rate that's ever existed, the lowest rate of deaths by war that has ever existed, the highest literacy rate that has ever existed, and the highest access to education that has ever existed. And this thrills me because I really believe that knowledge causes freedom and freedom causes healthy societies. And I'm really proud of the role that Harvard has played in that over 378 years. And I'm really proud of the fact that the Extension School has been allowed to light the darkness out there by extending Harvard's education around the world using our evening classrooms and using digital technology. We digitally amplify Harvard's light on the world. We bring it to you first at night, second by mail. Some of you may remember getting videos and then DVDs and now streaming over the internet. And the dramatic change is the two billion people that have been lifted out of poverty globally have access to the internet, they have access to education, they have access to control their future. What I want you to know is that your school, the Extension School, is getting better every year as we do this. As we digitally enhance education, as we bring that back to the classroom, our faculty, our courses, our certificates, our degrees get better. But that's not really the story. That's about the piece of paper you earn and what the brand means. The real story is the light that you bring to the world with your education. It's the ability of you to extend what you experienced here in your social, your civic, and your work activities. It's people like you that actually bring the light to the world that is the embodiment of what Harvard's meant for all of these centuries. I'm often asked what alumni can do for us. And part of the answer is stepping up to what we can do for you. We all know that education has this transformative power in the world. We all know that education is now a lifelong pursuit. And I want to invite you to keep looking at what we offer in our courses, our certificates, our professional development programs, our summer learning experiences, our hybrid weekends, our short courses, because there's opportunity for you to come re-engage with us and increase your knowledge and increase your contribution to the world. When I think about what you all could do for us, I think a little bit differently. As most of you know, we're proud to be economically sustainable, even at our very low access pricing. And I think what you all can do for us more than anything else is talk to your peers, your friends, the civic people you meet in your community, and encourage them to think about coming back to us for more education. We have the ability to grow, and we are growing dramatically without reducing quality, really with higher quality. And I think there's a real risk in the world today I think in America in particular, we're forgetting that freedom isn't free. I think the world is just beginning to learn how high the cost of freedom is. France has wrestled with this dramatically in the last week. The price of freedom is really high, and only education can ensure sustainable freedom, and that's what we do. So I want you to help us find more people like you. I want you to help us find people that can take our education and what they learn from each other and from us and change the world. And I want you to think about coming back and doing it more yourself. If you see fit, and if it fits your life goals, uh, we do accept gifts. Uh, we have charitable contribution. Uh, we are a 501c3. And we absolutely look for donations that can help us improve. Our biggest investment area in terms of doing this is what we invest in and what we call our CS50 Innovation Lab. David Malin and his team that brought CS50 to the world has a special lab where they experiment with new digital technology, and it's expensive. We spend several million dollars a year on R&D and new implementations so that we can bring more better education to more of the world. We want to keep bringing Harvard to the world for another 105 years, and that's the innovation it takes to do it. We want you to be more proud of us. And we think someday there'll be another dean sitting here and that dean will be talking about lighting the darkness in the world 105 years from now when we celebrate our 210th anniversary. And I want that dean to be able to brag about what we did today 
to engage our alumni, our students, our global communities, and to bring light into the darkness. Thank you.